This is a quick tutorial just to show how we can get a moving title and apply lots of changing colours. Um, it's very simple and let's have a look at the details. Let's have a look then at how we produce our changing colour title. The first thing we need to do is a bit of pre-production. So we will take a black colour board, drag it down to the timeline in order to make a black background. We must then apply a nice clean title to it in this example. Let's have a look at that and uh, look at its characteristics. So we will modify our title. I've already done it but we'll go through the steps. I've chosen a clean white title. The font face has no blur, no transparency. It is a uniform colour in white. There is no shadow applied to it, but I have applied a border to it. Given it a size, we won't be able to see the border because it's a black border, a uniform colour black, but it does give us a cleaner edge to a title. Uh, with it being on a black background, we won't be able to see it. We did have a motion effect on our title. I had a slide up and then pausing in the centre of the screen so we apply no effect at the end. You'll also note the title is centred using the centering functions at the bottom and it's also centred using the align text functions here. So that is the design of our title. We can now move on to produce it. Produce it into whichever format you wish. I chose to do it in this case to a WMV but that's a matter of your choice and where you save it to is a matter for yourselves. Okay, having pre-produced our title video we bring it into the media library and we can then drag it down to our timeline. We open up our effects room and we pick replace color and we drag that down to our effect track here. If we play this we can see that very little happens. If we look at the effect in a little more detail, then we have only four keyframes as a default. So let's go back to our main media library and show exactly how you get a change of colour. We take our pre-produced title, we place it into our main video track, we open up the effects room, we apply the replace colour, but this time when we look to modify it you will notice we've got a lot more keyframes. Now I have added keyframes at any point that you wish you can move your scrubber along here and this will become active to add a keyframe. I have already added the keyframes and at each keyframe if I move to the next one you can see that I have selected the white colour of the original title and I've replaced it with a colour of my choice, in this case a lime green. The colour range I've set in the centre, it does have varying effects. It's best to play with them because a little bit depends on the colour you've got, your monitor and the title and things like that. If we move to the next keyframe, the title is obviously progressed upwards. Again I've selected the original white and replaced it with a bright yellow. And we can see how this works when I move through the keyframes. So that's how the colour changes are done.
if we go to the beginning of the clip and we play the movie we will get our title changing colors as we have designed them to and that's it really a little bit of work with multiple keyframes and you can have a moving and changing colored title